my beautiful friends and welcome back to my channel. It's your vocal coach Tanya. I just got my hair from Germany because you guys don't know that I'm a big fan of hats and I used to wear them in Germany. I used to wear a combo of different hats but I wear them this way. I don't wear them that way like everyone does. I wear them the El Capone way. This way. <laughs> How in the world I didn't react to SOS? I had no idea, I never really fully looked at that video. I only looked at snippets from that video. But today, we're gonna look at the full video. Many of you already gave up on me because I recently made some videos in Russian. To be honest, it was a little bit of a really different thing for me to start to make some vocal reactions on Dimash in Russian. I am half Russian, my mother is from Russia, so that's why I speak Russian and I never thought that just one Dimash Russian video would get so successfully, so I, I thought I'm just gonna continue a little bit more with it. But guys, don't worry. I'm also here in English. It's your coach Tanya, don't forget me because I didn't forget about you. Are there no subtitles? Meanwhile, they should have made already some subtitles. In French, in French. Okay, just want to mention here that he just had in one sentence just made all registers. Like <laughs> he started from that one sentence very low, and then he went into that head voice part. So you see, one sentence can require you to sing the whole range, kind of like, right? Isn't it amazing? And um, yeah, that is this this song. I just want to mention here. We spoke a lot of times about singing in different languages, tongue positions. So whenever you sing in a different language. Your tongue changes, your position of your tongue changes, things change around here. Uh, it's really important also that the, the, the sound, the outcome. Um, when I speak in Germany, I speak like I think like one, one tone lower. When I speak in English, it sounds a little bit more higher than my usual uh, natural speaking voice. So yeah, big plus for singing in different languages. It's difficult and the stress behind, that's wow, even more difficult than keep up track with the notes. Very powerful.
they are all in shock at us now, of course. Hypnotized. I'm hypnotized. I'm speechless. What? I, I, I don't know what to say. I need a new life. So. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. It's there is like there is no other way to, than to describe Dimash as utterly uh, majestic and and, and, and and it is a phenomenon, you know. Especially here, you can clearly see and hear his uh, background and that he's classical trained. To sing like he sings um, and to go throughout those apaggio for the breaks that you have when you go into adolescence, but that is the difficulties. And this has something to do with a really good and fun technique and classical training. And he comes from classical training. And, well, there is no doubt about it that this is a phenomenon and someone who's hugely talented and someone also that worked very hard and has the right people to help him for all because just because you're talented doesn't mean that you're hardworking you know and just because you're talented doesn't mean that you have the right vocal coaches to help you to do that there are so many factors that come together when it comes to this so also sustain those notes in a long run in a long breath you cannot forget in classical music they sing those um they sing whole passages in one breath Really, in within those passages, you have a different amount of a different notes. You know, it really is a. It's it goes from very high to very low. You see, he goes from very low. He's very high in one breath, in one sentence. So that is it's a training and classical. It's hardcore. So it's really, yeah. So that is amazing. And of course, he uses the mixed voice, right? So when he do, does into that kind of screaming parts into that part where you think it's belting, sometimes it's belt, but sometimes it's mixed where it's a really, really, like a lot, it's really a good head voice, a little bit of chest, still a little bit chesty, but a little bit, but you know, it's so many things going on, it's amazing, absolutely amazing. Okay, my friends, uh, let me know in the comment section what you think about Dimash, and there are also subtitles in my other Russian-speaking videos, um, and Big kiss from the human Singapore. I hope that I can see him somewhere in, in Russia, for example. Then I would keep a track and try to go there. Well, of course, it's yeah, it's it's financially also not always easy to jump into countries to to see a star, right? But if he would be somewhere in Asia, probably in China, uh, that would be uh, yeah, much more uh, suitable for me with work and stuff to go there. So that that might be an idea actually if he's somewhere in China. Okay, my friends. Big kisses from the human Singapore. Stay happy, stay healthy. Hashtag weaponize your voice. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and don't forget to click the notification bell so you won't miss a video. And that would be super sad if you would miss a video. Mwah! See you in my next video.